missing something in your life? Wake up with us. Good morning. Catch up with this morning show. Is it... Has it ever crossed your mind though making a tape for, with you and Why your are husband? Why you so obsessed about this tape? Because he's a director. Like you know, they can actually make an entire video together. <laughs> you, know what, you know what I admire about <laughs> Rachel is that Yanni, she's not letting it go. It doesn't matter what you tell <laughs> exactly. her. Exactly. She's an addict. Me because I know this it has crossed your mind, hey, Vivian. How about you make your own damn yeah, tape? Yeah, I think Who you says should make one your... isn't already out somewhere. <gasps> Shh, don't try me, honey. <laughs> okay. <laughs> If not, madam, <laughs> can you make something happen? <laughs> Sam West, I know you're listening right now. You're a huge supporter of your wife. You really do experiment when it comes to colors in your hair, don't I you? I do. I do. What's I the love most it. outrageous hair you've yeah, hair color shake one eye? Like crazy kabisa. I think this is this has been it. Are you okay? This, because it's neon. Yes. So unakuwa ni kama ni reflector. You don't need a reflector. Your hair is just, it's enough. So it's already your, showing yeah. Yeah. Your hair, your And hair. this is one that people have made the f- most fun of. Really? Atizo Locas is in a tafuto kuminganana how green my hair is. <laughs> oh, my, oh my goodness. So I think this has been the one. This has been the <laughs> All right. Mm-hmm. Um, now, clearly, you have been a busy girl um, yep. when it comes to your music. From uh, last year, Hadi Sasa, Bumakam Meanza. Yeah. I don't know if you set yourself some, uh, let, let's call them musical goals for 2020. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Or like when you sit down and plan for your music, what are some right. of those, you know, things that you want to do this year? Um, this year, I'll definitely do a Vivi concert, ah. which will just be based on a more intimate experience in terms of my journey musically, because mm. now it's been five years and I feel mm. like I need to do something. Yeah. Because I think we have different trajectories for, for the male and the female artists. Mm-hmm. And honestly, as a female artist, Ukigonga consistently five years. Hey. G- Pat yourself on the back. Yeah. Do an event. Then if people say don't do it, you just do it. Just for yourself. Yeah, because it's a it's a really crazy space because you deal with a lot of egos. Mm. It's it's very male dominated. Mm. Studio spaces. Trying to put your foot on the ground. Being you know in Kenya we're still adjusting. I think in other first world countries they're like the woman can say things. Uh huh. True. But here it's still like. You know, we're living in that hypocrisy. To be uh, honest, I feel a, even as a female artist, but what people will tell my husband, Sasa, I'm be a I'm uh, like, okay, and we will definitely talk about that <laughs> because that is something that I am sure you have really seen for yourself. Oh, yes? Yeah, oh yeah, to talk about that and so much more. Um, uh, and the great initiative that she also has. Yes, dominate. We want to know what is that about? That sounds so kinky, girl. Dominatrix. <laughs> I, I see you. I see you. <laughs> Missing something in your life? <laughs> Wake up with us. Good morning. <laughs> Catch up with this morning show. Club. Waking you up. Weekdays from 6.